Coverage Master WinAMS is a unit test tool that provides automatic test data generation, executes the actual target code on a built-in MPU simulator, and provides statement, branch, and condition coverage data on the results in accordance with international safety standards. Here we will look at some of the features it provides and the optional functions available. First, let's look at the basic functions included in the standard product. Coverage Master Win AMS can automate unit testing using the actual object code on a simulator of the microprocessor to be used. All test results and coverage reports are output in CSV format for easy handling. Each function within the source code is tested to confirm the expected output values for specified input values, which are selected according to the branch conditions within the function. Measurement of coverage levels C0 and C1 can be completely automated, and the resulting coverage can be shown on a line-by-line -line basis. Stub functions, which take the place of sub-functions so that they do not influence the test results, can be created and inserted easily without impacting the original source code. Coverage Master WinAMS is also capable of testing the behavior of pointers, which can be allocated to specific areas of memory as required. It also allows a tolerance range to be set for the expected value of floating point calculations when comparing to the actual result to allow for precision variations. The source code and the assembler code generated from it can be displayed together when verifying coverage measurement results, so that the impact of compiler optimization can be clearly seen. Test results are shown in an easy to understand way with lines of code color coded to show the state of coverage and output that differs from expected results is highlighted. The test management tool SST Manager allows the user to select specific tests to be run automatically. The CPU simulator supports many different CPU types but also includes a general simulator for unsupported CPUs or for testing code in a way that is independent of the CPU type. One of the strengths of Coverage Master Win AMS is the ability to automatically select variables for use in testing the target functions. The source code is analyzed to determine which input variables impact the output of the function, and the user can then select which ones to use in the unit test. Coverage Master Win AMS can also assist in the design of black box and white box testing. Black box testing is labor intensive, requiring a detailed understanding of the requirement specifications. Functional safety standards require very particular evidence, such as those specified in ISO 26262, so there is a need for a defined process to standardize test design. GAIO Technology has many years of experience in software testing, and we have channeled that expertise into our test tools. Our analysis methods are optimized to make design reviews and cross-checks proceed more smoothly and efficiently. Our input data analysis algorithm can analyze the source code to determine automatically what variables should be used in unit testing and suggest test values such as maximum, minimum, and condition boundaries. These can then be confirmed and fine-tuned in a test data analysis editor. The test data analysis editor allows the user to examine the automatically generated test data and modify it to meet the needs of the test. The code structure is analyzed to determine the conditions that control the flow of the software and tests are added to ensure the greatest possible coverage of all flow paths. One example of the settings possible to fine-tune the test data is the selection mode setting, which decides whether calculation results are tested as well as condition results. Information from the requirement specification can be added to the test data analysis chart to make specification traceability more visible and quickly identify unused or unnecessary code blocks. Once the input data analysis chart is complete, it is used to create the test cases in the test case chart. This is also visually optimized to facilitate efficient design reviews. Attributes can be set to decide the combination rules for test values, such as maximum, minimum, and boundary values. Maximum coverage can be achieved even with nested branch conditions giving rise to multiple combinations. Input data is generated automatically to create test cases for every branch. Expected output values are also given in the data analysis chart, so the completeness of coverage can be easily checked if required. Charts generated by Coverage Master WinAMS can be output as Excel-friendly CSV or in HTML format. Input and output data can be combined into a single chart to give an overview of the test content, where omissions can be quickly identified. Coverage Master WinAMS can also generate test cases for the more complicated C1 and MCDC levels of coverage. Test data for C1 coverage can be generated automatically by testing both the true and false cases of each condition. In order to avoid redundancy in the test data, 
branches common to C0 and C1 should only be tested once, leading to greater efficiency in the evaluation of expected values and in the execution of the tests themselves. The C1 level data generated can then be examined to confirm what output data each test vector is designed to evaluate. For MCDC coverage, multi-condition statements are analyzed to generate input data that leads to the true and false cases of each condition being fulfilled. The input data generated is then analyzed to identify those combinations necessary to satisfy MCDC coverage requirements. The data chart then displays the data combinations and the conditions that each test vector is used to test. For all levels of coverage, the generated data can be edited to add extra conditions for specific cases or to remove cases considered unnecessary for some reason. Coverage Master WinAMS also includes a chart link feature which visually represents the condition tested in each test case in the flowcharts created by our code analysis tool CasePlayer2. Similarly, the tested execution path can also be shown in the flowcharts, which should greatly facilitate the explanation of test cases in design reviews. The following features make use of the abilities of the code analysis tool CasePlayer2. The measurement of C1 coverage and MCDC coverage is done using the code analysis capabilities of CasePlayer2. This code analysis can also improve the generation of test cases for these coverage levels. CasePlayer 2 also enables analysis of C++ code. Next, let's take a look at some of the optional features of Coverage Master WinAMS. MCDC coverage measurement is possible if Coverage Master WinAMS is used in collaboration with our source code analysis tool, CasePlayer 2. Measuring MCDC coverage requires that each individual condition in a combined condition be evaluated. This cannot be done without adding what is called hook code to evaluate and record the condition state at the time of execution. Thus, the MCDC coverage measurement is carried out using a target program with hook code embedded. The same tests are also performed on the target program without hook code, this time not measuring coverage. The purpose of the second test is to provide a set of test results for the same tests using the unmodified code to confirm that the same results are obtained by both programs. This proves that the addition of the hook code did not modify the behavior of the program. This diagram shows a detailed description of the process. The main execution uses the unmodified target program and thus should use the same compiler optimization options as the actual target. Conversely, the embedded code execution should be done with compiler optimization off to ensure that the hook code operates as intended. The comparison of the two sets of results will prove that the behavior of both programs is identical. Here we look at the operation of the hook code. Each condition is evaluated individually and its result is stored. The coverage display for MCDC coverage then shows the execution of each condition individually. We also offer an accelerator option to speed up your test activities. The accelerator option automates all the steps of unit testing. Just initialize the settings, select the functions to be tested and set the options for the test. When using the accelerator option, White box testing is performed based on the structure of the source code, but stub functions need to be prepared in advance, and if the coverage is incomplete, manual tests will need to be added. But apart from those limitations, the accelerator option allows testing to be almost fully automated. Next, let's look at function call coverage measurement. In integration testing, function coverage measurement is a measure of how many of the functions in a specific functional component are actually executed. Call coverage measurement is a measure of how many of the functions in a specific function are called. According to ISO 26262, integration testing is for the purpose of verifying that the software fulfills the requirements of the design and to provide sufficient evidence of this. The requirements for integration testing in ISO 26262 are set out clearly. Evidence must be provided of compliance with the design, the specified functionality, properties and resources, and effective safety measures. As part of the integration testing, the ISO 26262 standard also requires that function coverage and call coverage be measured in order to evaluate the structural coverage. Coverage Master Win AMS allows for function and call coverage measurement as an additional optional feature. Function coverage is measured by specifying the functional component to be measured. A test case is then executed and the functions called are recorded. Similarly, call coverage is measured by selecting the source files for measurement and applying a test case. The results show which functions were called, how many times, and the coverage rate. 
The standard format for these coverage measurement results is HTML, but CSV output is also possible. A detailed format output can also be selected, which includes call location and execution status for each function. The scope of coverage measurement can be selected on a file grouped basis. The execution status of each function call is shown below the function. Test data can also cover sub-functions called from the highest level of the functional component. Shown here are two common methods for integration testing. Big Bang integration testing uses a single test to achieve total coverage. Incremental integration testing uses a number of steps to achieve total coverage. It's important to understand the difference between call coverage and C0 coverage. Call coverage may include some calls that are not included in C0 coverage, depending on the test cases used. Functions that may interfere with the integration tests should be replaced by stub functions. This is also true for functions such as driver functions and standard functions which are outside the scope of functional coverage. Next we will look at the expanded command line interface features offered as an additional option. Among the challenges facing unit testing are automation, which is particularly desirable for regression testing, and traceability, which is needed to satisfy functional safety requirements. The command line interface allows features of the tool to be accessed from the command prompt, which means that those commands can be included in batch files and scripts for automated execution. Without the CLI option, only basic operation of the test tool is possible with command line input. The CLI option allows greater access to project creation and adjustment of a wide range of settings, as well as stub management. The CLI option can therefore greatly increase the efficiency of test design and enable the easy automation of test execution. Creation of a new project from an existing project is an easy task. Modifications to settings for the new project can be made using the command line interface. These are the main features of coverage master win AMS which are accessible from the command line interface. And these are the main features of case player 2 which can be used from the command line interface. This slide shows a very simple example of how test execution would be implemented in a batch file. Another optional feature we offer is unit testing readiness for C++ code. The C++ option allows testing of methods defined in C++ classes. For classes, object code is created for each instance of the class. Coverage Master Win AMS can measure coverage for each of these objects. This means that C0 and C1 level coverage testing are possible for C++ code. Coverage Master Win AMS is also prepared for Autosar AP development environments. Autosar Adaptive Platform is one of the big topics in test development recently along with agile development and a trend to see a larger number of stakeholders in development projects. Such trends have brought about differences from traditional development projects. For example, the difficulty associated with white box testing for C++. Agile development using the Scrum approach means that testing becomes a much heavier burden on the project. Black box testing is better suited to the Scrum approach and can help shorten the overall development time. Continuous integration also provides challenges for testing. Coverage Master Win AMS can interface smoothly with the tools commonly used in such projects. Here are some of the other challenges Coverage Master Win AMS helps to overcome using the software kit option we provide. The software kit option combines the Coverage Master Win AMS tool and the existing user environment into an effective and efficient development environment. Using the software kit option, test results from other frameworks can be integrated into the project, allowing testing to progress faster. Since the input data for Coverage Master Win AMS is normally in CSV format, it is not capable of handling large volume data such as video, as used in automatic driving systems, and communications log files. The software kit option enables DLL basic file access, so these types of large volume data can also be used in testing. The third benefit of the software kit option is that it provides support for the standard interfaces of STL and the POSIX API, removing the need for these to be developed on a project-by-project -project basis. This diagram shows how the test environment is changed by the addition of Coverage Master Win AMS. The portion of the system enclosed by the red line can be tested using Coverage Master Win AMS. The other portion, which cannot be tested as a black box, should be tested separately. Next, we would like to explain why Coverage Master Win AMS is superior to other test tools. These are some of the criteria commonly used when assessing software test tools. Coverage Master Win AMS can operate the test cases without the target hardware being present, meaning that tests can be administered remotely even before the target hardware is complete, 
with minimal maintenance and in a way that is the most faithful reproduction of the target object operation and that allows the full range of coverage to be measured. This slide explains how the coverage master win AMS test process is much less time consuming than traditional testing with an emulator. In the traditional method, test data creation is necessary for each iteration of the test, as is the manual execution of the tests. Thus, a lot of time is required for each round of testing. In contrast with this, Coverage Master Win AMS reuses the test data after the first iteration, and the automated tests themselves are completed in a comparatively short time, so the workload is greatly reduced. Looking at the detailed steps of the measurement process in each case, it is easy to see why Coverage Master Win AMS provides a much smoother, more efficient means of measuring coverage. Coverage Master Win AMS is fully certified for the functional safety standards ISO 26262 and IEC 61508. This certification was performed by an independent certification body and covers both the Coverage Master Win AMS and Case Player 2 tools for all TCL levels. We have also prepared a safety manual which describes how the tools should be used to test in accordance with the standard requirements. If this manual is followed properly, it becomes unnecessary to individually qualify the tools for the project being qualified. The safety manual is a controlled document and each copy is issued to a specific customer. Compliance with the processes described in this document ensures compliance with the functional safety requirements of ISO 26262. Specific versions of the tools are certified and these should be used when performing the qualification. These versions can be downloaded from a dedicated website that always provides the most recent certified versions. The IEC 61508 standard is a generic standard that covers many engineering fields. More specific standards exist for each specific field, such as ISO 26262 for the automotive industry. So how does Coverage Master Win AMS match up to these two standards? The Automotive Safety Standard ISO 26262 requires coverage testing of software structure in an environment as close as possible to the actual environment in which the software will be executed. Coverage Master Win AMS provides all levels of coverage testing using the actual object code. The benefits of testing using the actual object code include eliminating any possible effects caused by cross-compiler differences, optimizer issues, and the addition of code hooks. This means that the testing is highly reliable. Other test tools modify the object code so that even if the target environment is accurately reproduced, the code being executed is not the same as the object code. Our website includes many reports of applications of Coverage Master Win AMS to functional safety unit testing by various organizations and Coverage Master Win AMS has a considerable history behind it. This is a short list of just some of the many manufacturers and industries where Coverage Master Win AMS has proven itself. More information on the full range of test tools from Gaio Technology can be found on our website. Thank you for your time and attention.